without a doubt in my mind, I know that Shira wanted to make out with Hemet. No, they were twins. They were twin brother. That's twin cest. So what's your point? My point is that if there was a lady you, uh -huh. brown everything, gold miniskirt, right? You would, that would be appealing to you. No, not to me, but I guarantee you she would definitely want to make out well, with me. Well, that's incredibly narcissistic. Yeah, I don't disagree with you. Oh, hold everything. Why? Do you see this? I see poor city planning. I see a reading chair that is perfect for us. I see a reading chair I'm not carrying, Lynn. Why you gotta do to all my dreams? Look at this. Oh. Really? It's that comfortable. Homie, this is a bath in solid form. We need this. We do not. Yeah. You come home from work, you feel beat up. Uh -huh. Everyone on the street's a real diva. Yep. You got a frozen pizza to heat up, and now you can have a seat. Put your feet up. Or well, let's say by divine intervention, you meet a girl. You have my attention. She says, comfy chair, you start Frenching until you're entrenched. All I better unmentionable. I like that. I had a feeling you would. Take a second, think about it. It could really be good. You have a sit down. You can get down and slow down your little brown ass. Let me get another go round. Whoa, now, just a kind pick a minute. We gotta get it home, then we gotta get up in it. Well, who's gonna carry it? You're gonna carry it. Then we're gonna ride this bitch like a chair. Imagine all the magical adventures. I can almost hear my brain grow, bro. Rainy rainbow, yo. I'm gonna be like Johnny Five more in foot. And I can put my privates where they've never been put. Have I converted you to my way of thinking? Oh, yes, you have, sir. Woo! This is UTK. This is Lin Manuel. This is our TV show. Ladies and gents, we wanna thank you all for watching us this evening. Or maybe on a two inch screen. We are free. Uh, uh, oh, this chair is ruining our lives. Legs not back. Legs not back. Uh, hold on, catch break. Oh, oh, God. You killed me. What? This girl, Rachel, I just can't text at her level. But you're like a texting savant. Yeah, I thought I was, but how do you respond to this? Wow, she's talented. She's ridiculous. Her verbs are so active. She makes my participle dangle. Do you know what that means? Huh? Do you know what a participle is? It's a small Lift. piece of matter. Ugh. Just slide. It's this girl, Lynn. She just got me so in my head. So who's Miss Thing? I haven't even met her. Her name's Rachel. She responded all to this group text, and I liked what I saw, so I got involved. I thought I'd be wobbling on her wooblies by now. You UTK, look at me. Trust your thumbs. Yeah, thanks. I got this. I'm in. I'm gonna read the living crap out of this book. Hey man, I got a problem. I'm reading. My phone just stopped working. Did you try a soft reset? Of course I did, you undead biatch. That's hurtful. I know nothing about phones. Call Shockwave. Yeah, Shockwave. Zero one 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 zero zero one 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 zero zero zero. What the hell are you doing? Shh, let him work. What is it? It's off. Your service has been turned off. I'm sorry, buddy. He was a great little guy. Why did they do this to me? Did you pay your bill? What? Your phone bill. Did you pay it? When? Ever? Here we go. Yeah. Phone bills, gas bills, light bills, student loans. All go in the drawer. I'm a tiny drawer. Yeah, yeah. And I'm another funky drawer. Then I act just like a boss and forget about the drawer. I'm a tiny drawer. Yeah, yeah. I'm another funky invisible drawer. All these collection agencies ain't phasing me. It's painfully plain to see. I'm trying to get the third base for free. Glazing ladies, the rap race ain't for me. Paying bills just a white people game to me. I put it in the drawer, don't see the amount. Mm -hmm. If you a check of mine, you better know how to bounce. You better know how to bounce. Credit card, cable bill, Netflix, and gym membership all go in the drawer. Don't pay the bills. Yeah, yeah. Feed me the bills. I got a half of them. I may look 
like a draw, but I'm hung like a closet. Ooh, wee, baby, bubble, put it in the air. Ain't paying bills, no way, no how, no never. UTK's pockets stay empty, baby, bubble, and I'll stay fool. Yeah. Guys? Your real friends stay close, baby, bubble. Yeah, you're right. Hey, man, you hungry? Yeah, and this time it's on me. Really? Hell no. Listen, baby, listen. Here's how it's gonna go down, okay? You're gonna turn my phone service back on, then I'm gonna take that brief customer satisfaction survey, and I'm gonna let them know that I was very, very satisfied with your service. Baby? Edward? Yeah. Yeah, so, uh, called the phone company. It didn't go well. I know. Sound travels through air. I'm coming over. No, you don't. Let me get that phone. No, what? No. <laughs> Let me just send Rachel, like, three texts. Nah. All right. You brought this upon yourself. I will not lie down on your desk until you relent. No, you don't have to. Desk angel. Desk angel. <laughs> You can use it to lunch. Thank you, and I forgive you. You're an absolute monster. Memo train pulling into the station. I see two friendos waiting on the platform. Gents, hey, good dude, Thursday? Thanks. Pretty good Thursday? Totally not worth mentioning Crappy Thursday. Crappy Thursday. Shredder still works, huh? Ooh, Dead Plains, may I? How crazy is book three? Actually, I'm still reading it. Preacher Zombie coming back? Still reading it. And then the gypsy and the amulet? Still oh, reading it. The fire at the end? Still reading it. You, my friend, are in for a ride. Spoiler alert, it's awesome. That guy's pants are always so tight. I don't know how he wears them. You know what? These are uh, commuter pants, so they're tight for a reason. He's never gone. Nope. Don't want to get him caught up in my bike chain, right? Guys. <laughs> oh, hey, Wayne Brady. Hey. U T K. -K. Yeah, so that's man. me. I knew you knew it. Yeah, of course. Um, uh, so what brings you here today? Well, I was just checking up on my business. <laughs> See? Business. This is like a tree. And the tree has roots. Roots. The Wayne Brady Memorial Animal Clinic in Tucson, roots. Roots. The village in Africa that I built by hand, using other people's hands. Roots. Roots. This business? Roots. Because this is a tree. You're in a tree right now. Look down. High up, right? Because you're in a tree. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. <laughs> Embarrassing. Hello? Uh, oh, which one? Ah, uh, uh, hey. <laughs> who, who is this? Wayne Brady and I are like the same exact human being. Uh, you're pretty different. We are both talented and spontaneous non-whites. Okay. Lynn, he's got five working cell phones. Is that the goal? Is that the thing? Yes. Text alert! Rachel, wow, it's in trophic iometer. Huh? She's filthy. Hey, dude, that's my girl. No, no, I can't be running a text brothel out of my phone. One day you're gonna have kids and you will understand this moment. Fine, plan B. Just give me a ton of money to pay my phone bill. Okay, I'll just get it from I don't have any money. Eat your cereal. I don't even like cereal! I'll do it myself. I'll do like Wayne Brady do. And what exactly do we do? He starts businesses. He puts down roots. How hard can it be? I'll start my own little side business. I'll make a ton of money, get my phone back on, marry Rachel, uh, meet Rachel. I don't know, she might have a cute friend. Look, I can't be tied down. That was a horrible idea. You're just starting a business during lunch? Where are you going? Brad's, the office superstore. Oh, welcome to Brad's. Pretty much got this. Starting a business. Okie doke. Hi. Hey. 
How's your day going? Don't talk about dead planes. Don't talk about dead planes. How's your day going? Well, this is it, the moment you've anticipated Since the day Danielle was hired You've been practicing for this with bated breath How is your breath? No, don't check it in front of a man Danielle is waiting for an answer, you son of a How's your day going? You know, you know, just another day in the game I'm on my grind, girl, the more things change The more they be staying the same Check your frame, you put the damn thing I wanna be up in them guts and stop talking like bone thugs What? How's your day going? Why are we talking and not kissing? Stop, listen, I may not have a pot to piss in, but I'm not missing my shot. Listen, you're beautiful, a cutie full of moxie. You're foxy from your socks down to your deoxyribonucleic acid. I'm sorry for dropping science, but my instincts tell me I suffer from an over-reliance of multisyllabic sentences to say the simplest things and to what end? I like you like more than a friend. How's your day going? Uh, pretty good. Dead planes. Friendo Calrissian. Hey, to touch. Bit of a situation. Mr. Wayne Brady has ordered an enormous plant, and I need your help to move it after work. Uh, tonight I'm... Reading? Yeah. Doesn't really count as plants, does it? Well, see, the thing is... Allergic to plants. Yes. Lord Adine. Why can't you... Move it myself? A picture of plant continued on page 52. Page 52. So, yeah, two-person job. Who was it? Doug? Twigsy? Mr. Twigs? Uh, excuse me, young squab. Which one of these pins does Wayne Brady use? I have to ask my manager. You have no idea what you're doing, do you? You don't know me, Stapler. I know fear when I smell it, and I smell it. Your mother was right. You should have gone to medical school. Why, because I'm Indian and you're a racist bottle of white up? Oh, no, because you're always good at biology and you have a genuine passion for helping. Well, thanks, man. But you're crap for business skills. You'll never get no phone turned back on! <laughs> well, you're not even an office supply. You're just Puffs Puffs. Why? Brad's is a hostile and lonely place. You gotta come help me, bro. I'm reading. I'm cold. Text alert! Wow. What? Rachel again. She just texted you an NC-17 rated emoji haiku. Did she use Angel Baby? Utk, this is a serious threat to my productivity. That's exactly why you gotta get over here. Explain. Okay, you help me launch my business, my phone gets turned back on, she stops texting your phone, I touch mad boobies, probably hers, and you read and you read and you read. Okay, so I stop doing the actual reading I'm doing now to go help you start a business, which will maybe eventually possibly result in me someday reading again. That's the plan in a nutshell, yes. We'll be there in a second. So you have four water coolers and an eraser. Yeah, well, I might get thirsty and make mistakes. Do you even know what your business is yet? I got a few ideas. Number one, freelance t-shirt cannon operator. Yeah, I mean, they got them at stadiums, but what about more intimate events like book clubs, Boy Scout meetings, baby showers? They need a fierce blast of cotton, too. They have the right, don't they? I guess they have the right. New number two, Mr. Pickle Socks? Yeah, it's a children's book idea. Guy's got pickles for socks. Animals want to eat his socks. Mr. Pickle Socks. How is that a business? I have no idea. I desperately want to help you. Please say something that makes sense. Okay. Number three, I rent out my social services to guys that need a cool friend to hang out with for the night. Huh. It's kind of like a friendship prostitute. Nah, a friendship escort. You need a friend for the night, you call me. The Hangman. Hey, Liz. Son. I've been thinking again. I'm gone. You wanna be Danielle's main thing? Go on. Well, for half a Benjamin, I'll turn a loser land into a Lindian. 50 bucks. That means you'll be just like me, alarmingly charming. With the giant P can feel oh so free for a tiny fee. Only all you got to do is give me 50, 50, 50, 50, 50 bucks. 50 bones, 500 for dimes. Give me a grant, man. We can hang all of the time. 50 bucks, 50 what? 50 bucks, 50, 50 what? 50 bucks. Yup, and I'm yours. Shoulder on a plane or a train. You can text 
fast while I drive in the HOV lane. Okay, but please wait, I ain't no ultimate baller. I'll show you all the bomb spots for chicken, chicken, and salad. At the club, I'll be rude, making googly eyes. So all the girls start to notice your noodle surprise. Noodle surprise. Come on and go with the guys. This is a deal of a lifetime. Open your thighs. Hey, son, will you hold my hair when I'm fluish? Give me in a chair at a wedding if it's Jewish. You'll even pick me up from the airport. Yeah, boy, if you pay for the gas, I'll be there for 50 bucks, 50 bones, 500 redines. Uh, show me yours and I'll show you mine. 50 bucks, 50 bucks, 50 bucks. 50 bucks. 50 bucks. Yeah. Up. Receipt. Find everything you're looking for. You're good. And I'm yours. <laughs> 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 That is one sociable stick figure. Mm -hmm. He's curvy and sweet. I would totally hang out with this guy. <laughs> <laughs> I enjoy you! I enjoy you! <laughs> uh, Lynn, how about me? Would you pay me 50 bucks to hang out with you? He has no mouth. Come on. <laughs> Shockwave! This is happening! You look like a big old brat. Special on toner, nerds. My job here is done. Hmm. Let's hang out. Tempting. How tempting. Oh, he's wonderful. And right over here, all right. Ready, here we go. Woo, nice sketch, buddy. <laughs> Psst, 100 bucks, all night special. Actually, I have to. Text alert. Rachel? Uh, no, two touch. <sighs> hey, UTK, how do you feel about large plants? Plants have roots. I'm listening. I think I have your first client. You've got 50 bucks? No, I have 12 bucks and a Canadian loony. Such a nice night for this. Ha, huh, yeah, amazing Thursday. Right? Uh-huh. How many ninjas do you think are in the world? I don't know, thousands maybe? Really? Because I heard there's only seven. Sleeping giant? He's not sleeping. <sighs> hey, Wayne Brady. Hey. I was just reflecting on my life. Hmm. Yep, that aspect's going pretty well, too. <laughs> uh, we brought your enormous plant. Oh, my big plants. <laughs> We're going to put that right here. We're going to put it right here because it's a tree. Remember? It's a tree, and a tree has. Roots, exactly. And on top of that tree, there are leaves. You've got to take care of your leaves. Touch a leaf. Uh, touch a leaf right there. Uh, touch it. Uh, you never let anyone touch your leaf. Okay. You, touch a leaf. You're not going to hit me, are you? No, I'm not going to slap you. You never touch another man's leaves. Uh -huh. Yes. Oh, excuse me. Hello? Is it possible to have more than one Lifetime Achievement Award? OK. Where's Oslo? Norway, just outside of Lilyhammer. I'll be right there. Wow. OK, you guys, here. Huh? You take that. Huh? You take this. No sex in the champagne room. I'll see y'all later. I'm going to Oslo. I think I know what I'm doing with this. Got to run. Call me. Oh, he is just adorable. That's gross. Phone's back on. Yeah, Ziggazal. Who's the man now and who are you? Wow, Wayne Brady's a generous tipper. So did you pay off the whole bill? Hell no, man. I have principles. I only paid the minimum. What'd you do with the rest of the money? I finally met that girl, Rachel. Took her out to an obscenely expensive restaurant for really? dinner. Really? Mm -hmm. What was she like in person? 
Uh... Hey, Rachel. UTK, I hope you like this place. I, I picked it out myself. Sometimes I get breakfast here and coffee and, oh my God, you're so pretty. It's nice. What? It's a nice ambiance. I, I like the lamps. Yeah. You know, my cousin owns a restaurant and she says that lighting is yeah, just as important. Rachel, sh baby, you're beautiful, but why don't you text it to me? Text it to me. I guess your princess is in another castle. Mm-hmm. She wasn't my Winnie Cooper. Hey, man. Hmm. You want to sit in the chair? Really? Yeah, I've been hogging it. Take it for a spin. Thanks, man. This is Catan, and the question is, do you have any wool to trade? Huh? Barter some wool. Oh, I Nuts? Oh, nothing, nothing! 